And now, your selection. Meet the stars. Bless me, Father, for I have sinned. I'm Helsing! You murderer! Why can't you tell the world I work for you? Because we do not exist. My life, my job, my curse is to vanquish evil. The movie, I thought, had a great sense of adventure. Mm. And I wonder, what brings out the sense of adventure in you personally? I love all this kind of stuff. I, I grew up, uh, what, uh, my family, we'd all go camping together, we'd go hiking. There's, for me, there's nothing better than being out in the open, sleeping under the stars with a campfire, cooking your own food, trekking, being away from civilization. That brings out sort of the adventure in me. I think it does all of us, you know, and uh, that and a few beers. We need you to go to the east, to the far side of Romania, a land that is home to legendary creatures. I see the wolf man hasn't killed you yet. Don't worry, he's getting to it. Lorded over by Count Dracula. Growing up in, in the environment that I grew up, I grew up in the country in Australia, and, um, and I was relatively free as a child to sort of come and go as I pleased, and, and, and it, was, it was the countryside, so I could go, I could run wild, and, and, and I did. And um, I, I, I suppose that might have imbued me with a sense of adventure. It is a place where nightmares come to life. I'm Helsing. I get it from a five-year-old. I must say, there's nothing more fun. I have my daughter is now five, and I love to have being a baby and I'm toddling around and everything. But five is fantastic. She lives in a sort of entirely mythical universe with monsters and fairies and stuff in it. And so it just this movie is a kind of just continuation of that, really. He's the first one to kill a vampire in over a hundred years. I'd say that sent him a drink. Now, a man without a past. Do you have any family, Mr. Van Helsing? I hope to find out someday. It's what keeps me going. We'll face an enemy that never dies. I wondered if the Dracula ever comes out in you in real life. I'd say once a month it probably happens to me, you know. I think my, I, I actually asked my fiance if we could get a cat, and he said, I already have a cat. You know, because he'll be stroking me like that, and then suddenly go, ah! Dracula's way too sexy and, and confident suave for me. It's like, uh, but the only thing that brings my, uh, in my earlier days before I was married, probably, yeah, the jealousy. Uh -huh. You want to just dig your, or, or else, you know, lust. Oh. Drag is all about lust. Oh. You just want to dig your fangs into a good girl's neck. What is the technique for Dracula's kiss? The brides showed me on one of the other brides, but is there a technique? Do you, how do you go for it? How did you do the kiss? I think you just have to think about your hunger. Your, you know, I think you, you have to just sort of tap into your own kind of longing and um, then the rest is easy. He doesn't want to mince with it, he doesn't want to, he just wants to literally crush and, and feel bone going to powder. It's kind of primal and very angry, you know. Van Helsing.